Welcome to the MBS Engineering channel. Today, we are looking at the hopper heater's purpose, function, and hopper heater's operation set points and specifications in the baghouse and electrostatic precipitator. We will discuss this in the detailed description given below. The first topic what is the hopper heater's. The second topic is the function of the hopper heater's. The third topic is the hopper heater's set point and specifications. Next, we learn about what is the hopper heaters. The first point is, hoppers are part of ESP, baghouse which are located at the bottom of ESP, baghouse. The second point is the function of the hopper heater is to heat the hopper to prevent moisture condensing from getting collected in it and to remove fly ash from the precipitator. The third point is baghouse and precipitator hoppers experience plugging problems due to flue gas condensation. This is an expensive and unnecessary problem. The fourth point is a typical application for surface heating in the hoppers. The fifth point is reliable and effective hopper heating systems play an important role in the removal of fly ash from precipitators and baghouse hoppers. The hopper heater must be designed for preheating the hopper to prevent moisture condensation from collecting in the hopper during startup conditions in addition to maintaining the hopper and fly ash and dust above the flue gas acid dew point during normal operating conditions. The sixth point is hopper heaters are used to keep the inside of ash and other hoppers dry to prevent material solidification due to moisture. Next, we learn about the function of the hopper heaters. The first point is the sulfur in the coal carried over with the fly ash combines with moisture to form sulfuric acid, which attacks the hopper walls from the inside. Poor heating systems lead to hoppers that are paper thin and mechanically suspect. Replacing hoppers is very costly. The second point is hopper heating systems play an important role in the removal of fly ash from precipitators and bag filter hoppers. The third point is hopper heaters are specifically designed to preheat the hopper, ensuring that moisture condensate does not accumulate during startup conditions. The fourth point is in addition, they maintain the hopper and fly ash at temperatures above the flue gas acid dew point during normal operating conditions. The fifth point is these helps prevent corrosion and ensure optimal performance of the system. The sixth point is the hopper heater are self-contained heaters whose designs provide heat outputs up to 3 watts per square inch, with a maximum circuit size of 4500 watts depending on the application, the design of the hopper heater is such that it distributes heat over its entire surface. The seventh point is hopper heaters as a reliable and professional solution for maintaining the integrity of hopper systems and ensuring smooth operation in the industry. Next, we learn about the hopper heater's operating set point and specifications. First, we learn about the hopper heating element's operation and its set points. The low set point is 70 Celsius, it means heat is started if the temperature falls below 70 Celsius. The high set point is 90 Celsius, it means heat is stop if the temperature goes above 90 Celsius. The above set points can be adjusted based on the operating conditions. Next, we learn about the hopper heater specifications. The operating voltage is 415 volt, AC 3 phase. 
Next, the maximum watt density is 3 watts per square inch. It is designed to provide heat outputs up to 3 watts square inch, with a maximum circuit size of 4500 watts depending on the application. Next, the maximum operating temperature is 180 to 200 degrees Celsius. Next, temperature control, sensor heating elements like thermostats, or RTD, or PT100 are used for temperature transmitter and control purposes. Next, power and control connection. The power and control cables are supplied with a standard length of 5 meters and more based on requirements. Next, we learn about the hopper heater construction and installation pictures for better understanding. I hope everyone learns about what is hopper heaters, their function of the hopper heaters, and hopper heaters operating set points and specifications. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more videos.